hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm doing the updated review on the bastion bolt action pen that i received a few days ago and yeah so so far i've been really really loving this pen despite the heaviness that i initially mentioned in that video um i've been using this pen a lot over the last couple of days and i have to say i just thoroughly enjoy it i really do enjoy it um, right now in this video, I'm using it against this Tomoe River paper and it writes really really smooth I haven't had too many issues. I actually haven't had any issues using the pen thus far um, It doesn't lag or anything. There's no ink blotches I know I've mentioned ink blotches with some of my ballpoint pens in the past like the RSVP and even some of my big pens but i haven't had that issue with this yet so i've been just playing around with it and using it as my everyday pen in both my hobonichi my disc bound and my personal rings and all the above things that i'm using so yeah um i did order some refills for this pen i'm not too sure uh, what size the nib is on this one the box didn't give me any descriptions however the pen refills that I got I believe are a 0.5 millimeter and I will definitely share that with you guys once I receive the refills that I did purchase um, for this pen so just to talk about the pen a little bit this little ball thing that's sticking out that's actually how you access the pen nib so I played around with that thing a lot and I gotta say it is very fidgety um, and not in a bad way it's just like one of those things that you want to click multiple multiple times I will say trying to do it um, with different fingers like maybe my index finger or something is not the easiest it's kind of tight to do it and so I have to use my thumb um, but I feel like over time once you do it enough times it will kind of like smooth out and it'll be a lot easier um, on the left hand side of the screen that's the website I'm just showing you a general overview of like what all they have to offer they have aluminum pens they have carbon fiber pens they have a lot of different things and not only do they have so many different things they also have pencils um, with the same kind of um, body so lots of things to be offered via this company um, and yeah I really really like this pen um, I opened it up which I didn't do in the last video and this is I'm not really sure what kind of refill this is but this is one of their refills and I'm pretty sure that you can find some different refills to put in there but if you don't uh, find anything else they do make um, interchangeable refills on their site for a pretty reasonable price this pen is listed on sale that I saw um, so yeah that's a really good deal and I do have a deal for all of you they did provide a 20% discount code that you can use via my affiliate link and all of that will be linked down in the description box below I do make a small commission off of any of the sales that are made via my link and yeah I basically just wanted to pop on and share this pen review with you guys because I have really really been liking it you guys know I love ballpoint pens a lot and I've gotten really accustomed to um, <laughs> my favorites like I like the Bic and um, I do like the RSVP pens. I think those are like my holy grails of the pen collections that I have alongside the Bix. But if I can find something else a lot better than that, I'm all for it. And right now I feel like the Bastion, um, act, the Bastion Bolt Action pen is really, really uh, competitive in that area for me. They do make quite a bit of different options from the gel refills like I mentioned in the last video. And they also have a 
fountain pen collection. So lots of things to be offered via this company. And yeah, as of right now, I am just really enjoying this pen and I wanted to share that with all of you in case any of you wanted to try it out as well. So I thank you guys for watching. I thank you guys for giving this video a bit of your time. And yeah, I'll leave everything in the description box below if you want to check it out. And I'll catch you guys real soon in my next video. Bye guys.